How's it going, everyone? I'm Nostalgia Dave, and welcome back aboard the Nostalgia Train. So this episode is going to be slightly different than your normal. Um, but before we get to that part, empty room, empty room. I don't like this empty room. Uh, I'm gonna do this. I remember when I first played this game. I came here, I'm like, what the hell am I supposed to do? I didn't realize I was supposed to Skyward Strike this thing. Dummy that I is. Well, hello there, Hylia. How is you? Oh. Hi. Master Link, I have important information. When you struck the crest with the Skyward Strike from your sword, a message from the goddess awakened deep within my memory. The goddess intended this message for you, master. These are her words. Do I have to do your voice for- oh gosh. He who seeks the sacred flames, listen well for I guide you from my place at the edge of time. The sacred flames are three in number. To obtain them, you must also earn relics known as the Three Sacred Gifts. For each trial you overcome, you shall be blessed with one of the gifts. <laughs> okay, cool. Make use of the power of these gifts and you will find your way to, purif to the purifying sacred flame. Okay. Now I bestow upon you a melody. It will serve you as a key. Opening the first trial that awaits you deep in the wilds of far and woods. Okay. Give me it. This is a happy little tune. <laughs> I've never understood how Link could just suddenly know how to play these instruments. First it's a flute, then it's an ocarina, and now it's a harp. Who am I kidding? Wind Waker came before this, but still. That song is called for a race courage. It's rousing memo melody. Melody will guide you. You learn for a race courage. Cool. Bye. Bye, Hylia. I forgot to do something. All of you are probably looking at me and going, huh, I wonder what it is he forgot to do. Looking directly at what I forgot to do. If you've been following along enough on here, on these Zelda playthroughs, you know something is greatly amiss that I am having a very hard time fixing. There. Okay, OBS really doesn't like it when I, when I try to be on point to that. You must overcome the trial set before you and obtain the three gifts to reach the sacred flames. I have committed for Rory's courage to memory. Now you can use your dowsing. I don't want to. I suggest you set out for Far and Woods as soon as you are ready. Oh. Big chance I was possibly going to go there anyway, so, uh... No! No! It's not happening! <laughs> I guess the extra thing won't happen. So what I was originally going to do is I was going to go through each area and just go, Okay, so... Let's collect all the items necessary to help... Um... With 
actually upgrading everything, but I mean... At the rate things are going, that might not be necessary. No! Bugs are not allowed up my deck! Bad bugs. Bad bugazino. Bugazino no allowed! What? Stop looking at me like that! Nuh-uh. No, no, no. No, 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 no. Alright, we're out of here. We'll st we're gonna try to keep record. So right now I have a book that tells me stats of- ah! No! Tornadoes are fast to me. All right, so first stop, the bazaar. So what I'm gonna do, this is gonna be another off-screen thing that I do. Da -da -da, da -da -da. I might have been off there too. Hi. Hey, hey kid, how's Scrapper treating you? Anything to upgrade today? Let's find out. Uh. Okay. Time to do some math because I hate my life now. Apparently, because nobody likes math. Actually, in reality, I actually like math, but not other people. Not many other people do. <laughs> Alright, so that page is for playthrough later on, in a few days. Now I'm opening up a new page. Okay. Tumbleweed. I'm doing this one in tallies. Ancient flower. Hey, you, uh, hold, hold up a sec. We're thinking right now. Stop staring at me. I know you're growing impatient, but still, dude. Evil crystal. Which I have no idea where to get an evil crystal. Where the hell do you get evil crystals? Okay, can't do that one yet. How about this one? Nope. Hold the, hold the presses. We're going to put this on hold. We're going to put this on hold. We're putting this on hold. I just realized something. We'll be able to do this after our next tax. Bro, you know what? You know what, bro? Tell you what. I know. I'm sorry. We'll be back in a bit. Today's all about upgrading, except it's not. <laughs> I am going to buy this from you. Aha! That's a sacred shield. As you might surmise from its name, it can handle all variety of attacks. Fire, not a sweat. Electricity, no painful zaps. Plus, it will automatically repair itself when it sustains damage. That is useful. It's a little fragile, but that shouldn't be a problem for one as talented and agile as yourself. At a cost of 500 rupees. Okay. Means me to tell you, friend, but here's your pouch is full. May I suggest you some Blah! Fine! Hi. Yes, I'm back and I'm giving you both my shields. Because I don't like shields, apparently. We are gonna have to upgrade a lot of things here though. All of my break it says never get rid of the bottles and never get rid of this. Um for now, get rid of the shields. For now, I mean, likelihood of me using the shield anyway is slim, but bye. Hi, butthole. 
Yes, I know what it is. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you very much. I've taken the liberty of placing your purchase on... Okay, thank you. Bye-bye. Do I have... What? Hey, I was coming around to talk to you, dude. Come on! You got something new. Sacred Shield. I recognized. I already bought it. I can buy a second one. <laughs> I don't know how that'll be useful, but... Look at that dope sacred shield, bruh. Just look at that thing. Hide it behind a freaking purple claw shield thing. I don't know. Uh. Okay. So it looks like there's nothing much to take care of up here for now. But! After this episode, you are going to find next episode I will be doing better than our brains can handle. Okay. And call your damn bird. I am getting a message on my phone. This way. It's just gonna. Oh! Oh, well, this is gonna make things easy. Well, no. Because I'm gonna go here. Very specific reason. Okay. Hi. A report, Master Ling. I have detected the aura of a trial gate nearby. Have you now? If you can pinpoint the origin of this aura using dowsing... No! I will keep saying that a billion times if I freaking have to! Okay. So. <laughs> nope. Just gonna come over here. Oh, wait. There is something else we could do, too. Bombs. Yep. Hello, heart piece. Hello. Got a piece of heart. This completes the heart container. Your heart capacity is increased by one. Yay. More health. <laughs> There's one thing I almost forgot to do, actually. Because I is big dumb and can't remember Jack Diddley. Wee! Uh oh. We no likey. We get out of here. What did I just say? You know, likey me get outy. There we go. All right. Back where I need to be, more or less. In the sealed grounds. Now. You're still down here? I was expecting you to be up there by now. Dude. Ugh, fine. Waste of time. Well, yes and no. I don't know. Anyway, onward. I'm going to come over here where we started, where I'm heading off to because my brain don't want to. Hello? Whoa! Hi! Keith! You see Keith? You really 
don't like me, game. I tried to do that so many times, and the game's just like, yep. Game's just like, it ain't happening, bro. Fine. Go into solitude, then. Just come over here and just touch base with this golden, shiny light thing. Hello? Hello? Wow! Oh. Shut up. Orange banana peels were in the way. That was easy. This makes me feel like I should go squirrely on everything. I don't know. I feel like if I was starting to bark up a tree, someone might get mad. Just like start nobbing on the nuts in the tree. Something here is reacting to our performance of Aurora's Courage. I have confirmed the appearance of a strange mark on the dragon. I see that. I calculate a 90% possibility that this mark is a nut. I mean, trial gate. V, are you into nuts too? Let's go nut shopping. Disregard that statement. <laughs> As mentioned by the goddess statue we heard from on the Isles. Okay. Thrust your sword into the sand. <laughs> that does not work well with what I just said, Fee. Alright. Alright, enough. Enough. Ready, sword? There we go. I don't know, actually, in all reality, I like these trials. They're not that bad, either. This game makes them seem a lot worse than they actually are. Master Link, as expected, I cannot follow you into this realm. Well, this trial calls out to your mind alone. In the meantime, I'm over here chowing on some nuts. Don't mind me. It's nothing. This is the nature of places known as silent realms. They are domains of the spirit, accessible only to the goddesses chosen to roam. This particular trial, Aurora Silent Realm, Test the limit of your courage. Your spirit has temporarily separated from your physical body so that you may undertake this challenge. Are you done? Oh my gosh. To reach the location of the flames that will enhance your sword, it is necessary for you to overcome this trial and undergo spiritual growth. Okay. Cool! It's the thing for Twilight Princess! That is your spirit vessel. Actually, that's not too far off. When this vessel is full, I, they, yeah, so yeah, if you play Twilight Princess then you already know what this is, but basically the concept of this fill, fill that up all the way with the spirit things, and then once it's full, the trial ends once you come back to this spot. I know how to fill it. Master, do you see the glowing object just in front of you? It'll give me time. Once I step off, the, the guardians will notice. 
click that and it gives you time 15 seconds i believe to 30 no about a minute it gives you about a minute per to get away to of open space without getting ca caught unless it's by those hose carrying lights those things i'm skipping all this just because i know what to do and i don't want to just shut up i get it i just explained this <laughs> those things catch me i fail the trial shut up no i got it understood master i will be eagerly awaiting your return in the outside world may the goddess watch over you master Yes, I know. Uh oh. No. No! This is my nut! It's very green! I, I decided to dye my nuts green and then eat them. Afterwards. After I've gathered about 20 of them. I think I could get 20 nuts here. That actually. Yeah, that's gonna be really helpful. All right, time to go up here. Don't use that one. Or that one. Hello. Thing is, you don't even need to be up there for very long. There's another item I am looking for too, though. Do, do, do. Ah, there it is. One of these. A desk relic. That's gonna be important! You can only collect so many of those, though. Which is kinda saddening. Because those relics are fun! <laughs> I can't go up there. Fine! See if I care. I didn't wanna go up there anyway. need to keep like an open mind about where anything might be. I am running out of time. I just realized this. There we go. Alright. It is kind of weird how that works, but it, it's, it's all good. <laughs> But, yeah, I'm trying to keep an open eye for any dusk relics. <laughs> if you see one, tell me. You don't tell me, I'm going to feel betrayed. Very much so. Master Link. What? That, are you telling me about that? That water, if I touch it, it'll act. It'll do the same thing as if I'm caught. It'll wake the guardians up, and they'll come after me. I know. Thank you, though. One of these trees releases a dusk relic, but I don't remember which one. I'll go over there in a sec. All right, up here. And, ooh, more green nut! <laughs> I like my green nuts, apparently. I don't know why I like green nuts. They're just... They have some kind of appeal to me, okay? Green nuts are my fave, bro. Wish I could use bombs in here. I mean... Also, this has never really been that hard for me. I'm trying to be very thorough here. Is there a dusk relic down here? No. Okay. You can already tell how important Dusk Relics are in this game. <laughs> if I'm so worried about gathering of that. Hey, Dusk Relic! That's two. I'm not gonna overshoot myself. Go around the big Poe, butthole. Hello. I didn't expect that, to be honest. Oh, 
honestly. Nope. This tightrope is a lot easier to walk on than the than in the original game. It actually kind of sucked to walk on in the original game. Ah! Oh yeah. Uh huh. Ooh, that's a tight fit. <laughs> I got me my purple nuts. I got some green nuts. I like nuts. Bob likes nuts, apparently. Alright. Well, Bob's not the only one, apparently, that we know of, though, so really judge him for that. Everyone likes nuts. That's all we really need to know. You know, that would have been really helpful to know earlier. Uh, let's see. Oh, it's just a dead right opening. Okay. Oh, crap! No one saw me. Ooh. Where's all the dusk boys? There's got to be more than just three. Best to wait. I don't know if there are any dusk relics over here, but I do want to make sure. Ah, that's the one I was thinking of earlier. That. Thank you. Good. We're we're good here. My question is, how do I pick up that one? Oh. Oh, that was pretty simple, actually. All right. Yeah, I can't get up that one. That's fine. All right. That's actually kind of an easy find. <laughs> ah, we're back here. Okay. And there we go. All the great nuts have been found. I'm going to eat every single one of them. Then I'll eat purple nuts, maybe some yellow nuts. I'll probably mix in some blue nuts while I'm at it. Bob. That doesn't even make sense. Alright. Now the thing's not going to go down, which makes it nice to just explore a little bit. Have I been down here already? Yes, I have. Okay, I think I've actually explored everywhere. I don't think I missed a spot. So that being said, let's head back to the exit slash entrance of this area. We should also be able to upgrade some stuff after this. Upgrade some stuff. You gotta emphasize that grade. And maybe separately emphasize the up. Crap. Why am I lost? Stay. Yeah, I've explored everywhere here. All right, let's go. Don't get caught. Also, excuse me. Yeah, pretty simple. And... 
let's go. Let's get out of here. We want our nut buffet. I don't know why this episode's all about nuts. This episode on its own is just nuts. Ooh. That's going to help me on the side a lot, too. We actually do got some extra stuff we could do upstairs now. I mean, in the sky. I guess in a hi! Congratulations, Master Link. Thank you. You have passed this trial. You now have the power to proceed to the location of the first sacred flame that will enhance your sword. The water dragon skill is basically the flipper. One of the goddesses gifts, the great spirit of the water dragon has provided you with the ability to swim freely underwater. The flame you seek is somewhere within these woods. Master, I must conclude that this flame is likely in a part of this area you have not explored. No, duh! They're not going to make it that easy. This is Nintendo we're talking about here. They make things easy, but they don't make it that easy. Let's go to this guy. We got something to take care of up there. It's going to be totally great. All right. <clears throat> All things aside... I do wonder, do you have to have an item equipped to upgrade it, or can you just upgrade it anyway? We're about to find out. I've never thought of that before. Let's go upgrade some stuff. Hi. Hey. So, do I have to have the item on me? Yes, I do. Okay. I believe it was this. Let's do it. Alright. You want to upgrade this? There's no going back, you hear? Go for it. Let's do it. Finally upgrading things. It only took forever and a half. <laughs> All done. Here you go. You upgrade to the mighty scatter shot. If you got anything else you want me to tinker around with, you just let me know. Do I? No. I don't know where to get an evil crystal. No, I didn't need to do that. Need a hornet larvae for that one. Yeah, that one can't do it for Jackson. Got a lot to do there. Yeah, we can't do Jack. <laughs> well then. Oh, thanks. Come again soon, you hear? So we could upgrade one thing at least. That says something. I didn't already talk to you. Air potion. Oh, to help you with oxygen. Nah. Why not just have me drink out of a bottle empty? Isn't that basically the same thing? That's weird. An air potion? That is weird to think about. All right. So now that we've got the dragon scale, we can finally swim. Oh, right, I can just hold it down. I'm used to be to swimming. I'm used to, like, the whole, like, spam the same button to be able to swim. Ta-da! That's what I meant to do beforehand. Oh, two treasure chests. Nice. 
What's in the first? Okay. What's in the special one? Nuts! 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 Aww. <laughs> nice. Alright. So, with that done and done, can we open this from the inside? Or is that, is that even a door? Is that even a door? I don't know. Alright. Okay. So, with that done and out of the way... I'm going to leave this here. So what I'm going to be doing at the beginning, the reason I'm leaving this here is that at the beginning of the next episode, I am going to go upgrade everything we can at the gear shop. Because as I said, I'm going to try to upgrade everything. Which is going to take a bit, but I'll see what I can do. If I change my mind, you will find the episode starting um, in Far and Woods. So we'll see. But either way, I am going to leave this video here. Thank you guys so much for watching this nutty episode of The Legend of Zelda Sky Resort HD. If you liked it, make sure to push that like button and so far you can't see it anymore. If you really liked it, consider subscribing to the channel. Have a suggestion for a Zelda game you'd like to see on here? Let me know in the comments below. Want to check out one I've done prior to this? Click the link across my head here and try to take you to that destination. Or if you missed any of the stops on this particular ride, click the link at the top right hand corner of the train to take you there. But in the meantime, this train's off to its next destination, but we hope to catch you guys in another ride. Bye!